Take a look. Hey Wilder, this is Sheriff Woody, and he is a cowboy. No, no just sheriff marshal. and he, a marshal, and he comes from a line of gunfighters. That's my great grandfather, right there. Let's see. That's that's his great grandfather. And if you look over there, the Doc Holliday, the picture on the wall. You see the resemblance? Yeah. Is that Doc Holliday? Uh, that's what I thought when I first saw this picture from one of my relatives. Uh, here's what's even more scary and is 100% true. He was born in the same decade and in the same part of Georgia as Doc Holliday. Wow. We have not made a genetic connection, but my family goes back to the 1790s in the United States. We fought both in the Civil and Revolutionary War. Wow. This gentleman right here. Is my great grandfather on the other side? Come on, picture. <laughs> He's showing pictures of his grandparents. It was his son that shot the other guy. Now he was in the Civil War as well. That's cool. And uh, both, so it's a real old picture right there. Now, if you don't believe me, you think I'm a BS tombstone person. Oh no. <laughs> BS. So, Sheriff Woody, I see you got a gun right there. Which one? <laughs> <laughs> That's my, you know, Charles Bronson? Yes. That's my Charles Bronson look. There, there you go. go. Perfect. Very good. Richard Boone and Tommy Lee Jones. Wow. Okay, let's see. Uh, what was it look like? So, do you actually do the gunfights here in town also? or? Well, we were until a week ago and had a shooting happened. What happened? Oh, national news? I didn't know No, about that. no I, I, I'm so out of the news all the time. It's, it's terrible. Uh, someone got actually shot here. They got actually shot here? Yes. Uh, the guy was not using the brakes. He accidentally showed up with uh, six live rounds. I was on national television. Oh, my goodness. And, uh, I'm the armor for our group, and I'm the one that checks the guns. And he apparently showed up late and was not checking. Someone didn't check his gun and he had five live rounds in it. Oh my goodness. And fortunately, he did follow one procedure. We were taught to shoot down and to the left or right, not directly at the person. Right. And the round bounced off of the uh, pavement, hit the guy in the billet of the gun belt, and then lodged in his abdomen and we had to fly him to Tucson. I'm sure he was okay, I hope. As far as we know, I, he was out the next day and I think he's turned out pretty good. But right now, good. they're. Kind of putting it to box on the gunfights and the time. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is what I was looking at. That is the actual article that you can Google on the gunfight with my grandfather and great grandfather. Wow. It says Mount Pleasant man killed following a quarrel. Mount Pleasant, Texas, October 14th. Burl Tiger was shot and killed a few miles from here today following a dispute with Will Cobb, Tiger's son in law, who was charged with killing. Details of the crime have not yet been learned here. See, back in the old days, people settled things. That was 1910. 1910. Yep. And the shootest, John Wayne, was right around that time period. Yeah. This didn't become a state until 1912. Wow. So it was That's still, right. still right. When I came here when I was a little kid in the 50s, uh -huh. um, it was very much like it was in the old west. There was wow. still cattle ranches around my house. There was a lot of wild animals. Wow. Um, I've got documents here that show when I came here in the 50s when I was a big boy, uh, 1958, when my first Colorado was done here when I came here as a child. So Sheriff Woody, this is a picture of me. Oh wow. There, there he is. Boy, and that's my, uh, this is he's, four years been, old. he's four years old. That's how old I was there. Now Sheriff Woody, one of the questions Water would want to know is, are you a good guy or a bad guy? I'm a sheriff. So he's a good guy. So what Some would, people don't consider Wyatt Earp a good guy. I do. <laughs> so Wilder is a good guy, too. What would you say is a good thing for a good guy to do? As far as what? For a four-year-old. Follow the cowboy code. Look it up. Roy Rogers Cowboy Follow Code. Follow the cowboy code. Obey your parents. Obey your parents. Pray. Pray. Read your Bible. Read your Bible. Go to school and get good grades. Go to school and get good grades. I can't remember the rest of them. There's like <laughs> ten of them. But, but you can look it up. The Cowboy hey. Code was Roy Rogers. And you know, one reason I came here yeah. is uh, children like your... your Wilder. Is it your son? Yeah. 
they don't have people to look up to. Anymore. Yeah, it's tough. I did when I was growing up. You could always look on TV and it was always some cowboy movie or something. Uh-huh. It was always had morals. Mm-hmm. Uh, it was always really good. <laughs> he was my son. I would raise him on nothing but old cowboy movies. They yeah. Good morals. It was great. Uh, it was a good thing for a kid to learn by. They learned gun safety. They learned that every time a guy was shot in a lot of those series, mm-hmm. there was always an explanation. Sure. And then it wasn't. Even though it was justified, it wasn't something that the individual enjoyed doing. Right. It wasn't glorified. In other words. Well, I'm going to send this on YouTube to my little son. It's okay. a little thing, if that's okay with you. Tell him I said hi. Sure. And tell him not to get mad at me. Okay. Because uh, I ar- arrested Sheriff Woody in Disneyland. You arrested Sheriff Woody in Di- He arrested Sheriff Woody in Disneyland. See right here? Oh, my goodness. Look at that. He was impersonating an officer of the law. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, that's a, that'll get you in trouble. But tell him we're really good friends, and he had a good time. But Wilder, we, were, we were just playing around. Wilder, this is Sheriff Woody. He's a really good guy, and uh, and I can't wait to see you again. And uh, this is your come, message for Come me. see us in Tombstone. Well, we'll come to Tombstone, to Tombstone sometime. <laughs> you can meet all the cowboys around here. Yeah. You take care, buddy. I love so, you. Bye. How come you